Forgiveness in court from the local deputy who says he saw Jesus moments after he was shot in the line of duty. In a surprise move today, the gunman, Daniel Witzak, pleaded guilty and was sentenced for shooting two deputies in Lakeside. 10 News reporter Steve Fiorina is live with emotional words from those deputies. Steve. Kim, both deputies expressed forgiveness for the man who may have ended their careers, but also concern for two little girls that he molested. The deed that began the court process here. The wounded deputies had thoughts to share with Daniel Witzer. I wish I could get those nightmares out of my head, but I just can't right now. I hope that one day the memories of that horrific day will fade or go away altogether. Then a softer tone. I will tell you that I have forgiven you. Words echoed by the man critically injured that day, Detective Ali Perez said Jesus appeared to him moments after he was shot and spared his life. That I forgive you, that I'm not angry at you, and that I really hope you take this opportunity to turn your life to Christ. This 10 News virtual view illustrates the gun battle at the Maplewood Apartments. Witzak was in apartment 72. When deputies knocked on the door to arrest him on child molestation complaint, he opened fire with a high-powered rifle, wounding both. Other deputies and a San Diego police officer who'd been driving by rescued the downed deputies. Sergeant Johnson was taken across the landing and into the opposite apartment for protection. Detective Perez was dragged down the staircase. After about 15 minutes and occasional bullets flying, Witzak gave in, suffering multiple wounds himself. All three in court for the sentencing. Witzak's guilty plea brought two life sentences with parole plus 80 years in prison. Afterward, thoughts about Witzek's avoiding eye contact with his victims. I didn't expect him to look up at us. I didn't expect him to say anything. Uh, there's not much he can say. And Detective Perez holds on to his encounter with Christ as he lay wounded. All the time. I'm only alive because of Jesus. There were three officers in, or deputies injured in that standoff last September. At 7, we'll look at the deputy who was not wounded by gunfire. Live in El Cajon, Steve Fiorina, 10 News.